Hello, trading has closed on April 22nd, 2024. We'll do our disclaimer, go over our calls, and then make some predictions. It's my trading plan for tomorrow, which is April 23rd, 2024. Please remember my calls can be wrong. Trade at your own risk. Rules of my system can be gotten here. At the very least, stop the video and read this if you're not familiar with it. We said uh, there was a good chance of a bounce today. We had a few targets. One was 49.83.97. That one printed. That's support right at that price. And we also said that the break under this red trend line shouldn't stick. That we should retrace to that line. And we did that, so that was satisfied. Now during, this is just a reminder of what we said, number of reasons, look for recovery of sorts, but I don't think the whole pullback's over, so regardless of how high this pullback goes, this, this recovery goes, I don't think this, this drop we've started is over yet. During the day, me, JT, gave a signal to buy, and that's already played out. Well, here's your inverted head and shoulders. You take the height, you add it here, you get your target for the move. That's it. We stopped right at the target. So we get the target of this pattern. We get the me, JT target. We get that trend line. It doesn't mean we have to stop here. I just don't have anything saying we go higher. And if you look at the wave count, this isn't my favorite count because C and A don't have a FIB relationship, but they don't have to. This rally is an ABC with a FIB relationship, and it stops right in the fourth wave of lesser degree. I mean, we had this big rally to resistance and then stopped. And this pattern usually closes to the high, and that's not it. Now, time doesn't run out until tomorrow. I mean, you gap and take this high out and go up here. No reason to pull back. But if we can't take this out, we rally to resistance and then turned around. And we can't add to this. The downtrend's still intact, if you ask me. So tomorrow's pattern has really low, which doesn't tell us where we open. Today's normally bullish pattern didn't close near its high as it normally does. Time runs out early tomorrow, so if we don't gap and promptly overtake Monday's high, we should see lower prices Tuesday, even if we don't close lower. The market hit its MJT target, satisfied the required return to a major trend line, and stopped right at the target of an inverted head and shoulders pattern. Even though the VIX Bollinger Band reversal buy signal is active here, I don't have anything requiring the market to add to today's gains tomorrow. It just can't be good when we hit the targets and promptly reverse. Now again, time doesn't run out until tomorrow. That could all change. But for right now, for right now, we've stopped the resistance. Bulls need to add to today's gains early tomorrow, or the decline remains intact. Any reversal needs confirmation the next day. It's not looking good here for the bulls, but you take this out early, that can all change. But Till that happens, I think we'll see lower prices tomorrow, regardless of how we close. It's a pattern with the early low, and that's today's call.